access your <clears throat> televisit appointment. Um, so there's a couple ways to do it. Uh, way one is after you get scheduled for your televisit, you're going to receive an email from our medical group, and it's going to have a link right here. And if you're on a computer, you can click this link, and it will open the televisit directly. Okay. And the other thing that I also want to show you is you can go to the patient portal page if you don't want to launch it from that email link. And the address is right there to our patient portal page. And if you need help finding this patient portal page or you didn't get the email, please call the office and they can help you with that. So I've logged in and I'm at the dashboard here. And right here is my visit with the doctor. Now I'm actually filming this on the 24th of March. So this is three days in the future, but I could go in today and get a lot of things set up for this appointment. So I click this join televisit button here. And you have to fill out some information. About the medication you're taking. And so I'm just going to kind of arbitrarily pick some things here. So um, I had an appendectomy, so I'll pick that. Uh, you fill out some family history here. So. I'm just arbitrarily picking things. This is not uh, exactly the truth for me. But just so you can see what happens here, you enter some, you know, all your family history here, answer some questions about your tobacco use, your alcohol use, um, answer some questions about your caffeine intake and your college education, if you had any. Um, how many times you exercise and you know all the basic stuff that you would answer when you first come to any doctor's office and then you would list other doctors and when you're done with that and feel like you've completed that you can submit this questionnaire you'll come to the vital screen here and you enter some information um, you know that you know about yourself you might not know your blood pressure you might not know your weight that's okay Put in what you know. Um, you can actually do a system compatibility check. And unfortunately, because I'm making this video with this computer, I can't also pass the check. But if you have a web camera and a microphone and some internet, you're probably going to going to pass the test. You're going to see the green check boxes here, and then you can proceed. So this is just because I had the air. You won't see this when you when you pass. Um, on the next screen here, there's a consent form that you'll have to sign um, or accept. You can't sign it and you accept it. And then since my televisit's two days from now, I actually can't start the televisit. But you can start your televisit 30 minutes ahead of your appointment time and that'll get you into the virtual waiting room. And if the doctor's available, they could maybe start you know, early, but, but at least um, they'll be looking for you around your appointment time. And so at the very least, maybe start 30 minutes early so you can fill out that questionnaire and your vitals. Um, and I hope this, is, this has provided some benefit and answered some questions that you might have had about accessing televisits for our practice. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you so much for choosing Hill Country uh, Memorial.